Park West Fine Art Museum and Gallery is continuing its Artist Showcase Series in August with a free exhibit and a fan event with world-renowned metal illumination artist Chris X. <laughs> He's joining us now in studio to tell us all about it. I love the, uh, the illumination as in aluminum. Yes. A thank play, you for a little play on words. Yeah, <laughs> thank you for joining us. Walk us through some of this stuff because if you could see this in the studio right now, this is almost three dimensional. This is amazing. How do you do this? Well, I start out with a, a raw sheet of aluminum, and then the effect that you see in the background is grinded into the piece before I add any paints. And then I use candy coats, which is a transparent paint, which allows the reflective quality come through and tinting it without covering it up. So I work from large spray guns down to airbrush, and then the details are done with fine, you know, small this traditional is, brushes. This is fabulous. If there is a way, I don't know, I'm going to get my hand out of this picture, uh, to, to get the camera to move just a little bit while we're up close on one of these so you can, you can see it, it just, it moves. It's, it's amazing. It's, it almost glows. Yes. So you, you, you said you started painting cars. Yeah, I did uh, cars and motorcycles, and then, you know, did a job for an art gallery actually carrying people's <laughs> art and said, hey, I want to do this. And two years later, I got into the same gallery, and that was about 18 years ago. That's amazing. Let's move down the line. I want to show some of these. This is another one. If you could see this in person, there's just the, the it's been brushed, right? Is Correct. It, that's how I you use do a it. grinder to really get that design in the background, and it works really well with the water. This is one of my whale tails which I just started painting about a year ago after my first trip to Hawaii. <laughs> so a lot of my artwork, I put little, my personal experiences into it, and uh, there's a lot of labor, but it's a uh, labor of love. Uh, yeah, I was going to ask where, where you come up with some of these ideas, um, because, you know, artists are always talking about uh, their inspiration, but you don't strike me as being uh, one of those eccentric artists. You're just kind of a... No, I'm just a hard worker. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That... Okay, let's move along. Uh, okay, I got to say, this this is my favorite down here on the end. Um, well, I'm an ocean lover. I'm a beach person. Right. So I do a lot of uh, beach scenes, and the grinds work really well with the water. Right. So I really have to have a blueprint before I do a painting, so the grinds make sense of the finished product. Now, what do you do, like, the, the palm trees? Is, is this that fine airbrush yeah, that you were those aren't, talking this, about? All the, the, the palm trees and the brushes are done with actual traditional brushes so there's no airbrush in there wow so how much of your work will the will your fans get to see uh, if they come out to the exhibit I think they told me they have like 68 pieces Wow so they're not all hung <laughs> <laughs> but well, uh, will there be an opportunity for people to purchase anything or is yes, it just yes, a show? everything's for sale okay and I love doing shows because I love forming the relationships with my collectors right. so for me to do this that's what I'm good at talking to them explaining actually how much goes into the work and uh, that makes it really an art experience right so what what's next what can we see uh, uh, in the in the frames in your your next step well when I get back home I'm gonna get into sculptures so I haven't made my sculptures in about two years wow. so I'll work on that and and orders and you know just uh, I work seven days a week. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, obviously, you love it, and it shows. So uh, I want to let everybody know, the, uh, the exhibit, there's the information on your screen. Uh, it is uh, August 27th, 4 to 7 p.m. It's a free meet-and-greet Q&A. Get a chance to talk with Chris. Uh, watch him uh, in work live yeah. for real, and this will be at the Forum Shops at Caesars Palace. So, uh, Chris, thank you for joining right. us. Thank you. We really appreciate you bringing in uh, some of your stuff.